Hi everybody. Um, I want to share with you guys a workaround that I discovered out of necessity and that's a way to stop students from resubmitting work on Google Classroom. Generally I love the idea of re being able to resubmit work. It means that the students are able to look at my comments and respond to them or change or edit as um, they see necessary. Um, but in the in the um, instance of exams or quizzes, we don't necessarily want our students to be able to um, go in several times and re-go over and change their work. And we certainly don't want them to hand something in and then go talk to their friends and uh, realize that they should change their answers and go in and do that. So I'm first going to show you um, a classroom as a student. I'm signed into my own classroom as students and you can see here that the top assignment is um, the elevator speech first draft and when I go into classroom um, I also can see here elevator speech first draft and if I go into it um, I can view the assignment. This is all as a student and I can hand it in. Even if I've already handed it in, I can then um, change it and do whatever I want. So now let's go to the same classroom as a teacher. Um, so now I'm a teacher. Here I am. Um, I am going to go in as a teacher and I am going to go to that same um, assignment, Elevator Speech First Draft in Young Diplomats 5. And I am going to now edit that in a way so that the students can no longer see the assignment. Now, it doesn't let me save it for some reason when I delete everybody, so I'm only going to delete for now um, myself. I haven't found a way to work around this yet, but I'm only going to delete myself for now. Or the other thing that you could do is put yourself in the classroom and only undelete everyone but you. But okay, so now I'm making it so that this person, that's me as a student, so that this person cannot see the assignment anymore. I'm going to save that. I'm going to save that setting so that when I go back in there as a student, um, I won't be able to see it. So, okay, so now I'm going to go back into Google Classroom as a student, meaning I'm going to switch over here to my student account and join Google Classroom as a student. and go to um, Young Diplomats where we had that elevator speech as the top one and as you can see it is no longer available at all to me. In fact the first thing that comes up is the Nearpod and also on classwork I can no longer see the elevator speech as an option which means essentially that I cannot go back in and redo it. So um, beyond using Google Forms, which absolutely lets you turn off um, the ability to accept more answers, which is another way to work around this, just turn your uh, quiz or test into a form. But if you want an assignment that you, um, let's say a written assignment or something like that, that you don't want them to be able to uh, edit anymore, that's the best way that I found to do it. So good luck with that. Um, hopefully you found that helpful and um, good luck using Google Classroom.